Today, I'm going to share 10 life-changing minimalist hacks that will make your life easier, simpler, and better. 1. Have a spot for items in different parts of the home. It's normal to have things in a room that you spend a lot of time in that belong to another, and having a spot for those things can change everything. This is because it'll make tidying up your home a lot easier, and you'll find your house gets cluttered a lot less quickly. You can have a specific basket, and at the end of every day, you can bring all the items you place there to their proper spots. 2. Focus on what you want to keep. Sometimes focusing on what you want to get rid of can make decluttering a pain. It's hard to let go of things we possess, which also makes it more likely not to let go of something, ultimately defeating the point of minimalism. A great way around this is to focus on what you want to keep as you declutter and make it a positive experience. 3. Make daily tasks easier We all have daily tasks that need to be done daily, like cleaning up the kitchen or brushing our teeth. It may be hard to get these tasks done because of other life priorities or simply a lack of motivation from the tediousness of the task. But a way around this is to break up complicated tasks into small segments. For example, if you hate cleaning up the dishes while you cook because of how big the pile gets, then clean up as you go. If you use a bowl to whisk some eggs, then as soon as you're done with it, put it in the dishwasher. There are many other tedious tasks out there, so let us know in the comments what minimalist tricks you do to make tasks easier. 4. Don't swap tasks. It can be hard to find a groove when you're doing work or chores, and you may frequently switch from task to task. Unfortunately, research has shown that it causes you to take longer to finish any task because it's harder for your brain to keep up. On days you have a lot of things to get done, focus on getting one thing done at a time. You can plan and go into detail about how much time you want to spend on each task and even at what specific time you'd like it done. 5. Grab and go. Whenever you leave a room, grab anything that needs to be cleaned up because it helps keep your house clean and clutter-free in a more efficient and easy way. For example, if you were drinking a cup of coffee and eating some cereal, when you get up, bring the dishes into the kitchen before you leave for work. 6. Keep out-of-season clothes in storage. Moving your stuff into storage as the seasons change is an effective way to keep your closet clutter-free. Having clothes for all seasons, for example, having big socks, boots, or jackets for the colder season mixed with summer attire takes up a lot of space. By getting a box bin, you can store season-specific clothes and keep them out of the way. 7. Use gateway storage. Gateway storage is a place to store your maybe items that you aren't sure you need. This is a great way to find out if you need or want any of the items in there. If you reach for an item in the maybe pile, chances are you can keep the item. To do this, get a bin or box and label it as the maybe pile. And if you don't use an item there within three months, then you can get rid of it. 8. Change isn't always necessary. Seeking out new things can be thrilling, but it won't give you lasting happiness. It just turns into an endless cycle, where when you get something new, you get bored of it, and then look for another new thing ultimately turning you into a high-level consumer. Instead of seeking new thrills, find new experiences and enjoyment in the things you already have. For instance, you can read a book you really enjoyed five years ago to experience it with new insight. 9. Use season changes as a chance to declutter. As the seasons change, see what you used in the season when storing it away. Chances are you didn't use all the attire you have available, which can help you declutter. Do this by going over the items you have. And if you find items that you didn't even know you have, then it's best to get rid of them. Before I share this last time with you, let us know in the comments whose frugal living tips you'd like to see in our upcoming videos. 10. Bundle tasks together. A unique way to get annoying tasks done more easily is to bundle them together with things you enjoy. For example, find tasks you enjoy, like listening to music or podcasts, and pair them up with a chore like cleaning the bathroom. This way, you may even start looking forward to those tasks you once hated doing. 